Right, what a day for Wrexham FC as finally, after since March 2020, we welcome back fans to the racecourse ground. It was for season ticket holders only to go and watch and it was against Curzon Ashton. We ended up getting the win 3-1 in the end. I'm just going to give you sort of a match briefing, match report of what happened in the game. Unfortunately, I couldn't be there because I don't own a season ticket, but from the sounds of it, it was a very good day out and very... Good to see fans back in the race course ground. So it was Curzon Ashton who started the game off, as it sounds from the match centre, better off as Dibble was forced into some early saves, denying Dale Whittam from 25 yards out and Alex Cur Curran on a one-on-one -on -one situation. So Dibble once again standing in for Rob Lainton, who I do believe is injured at the minute. Who knows, could Lainton be injured for the first game of the season will Dibble have to come in and fill his boots but yeah it was an early chances for Kurz and Ashton but we Wrexham quickly followed up Jake Hyde with two quick fire shots in the 25th and 27th minute one looping over the bar and the other stopped on the line by Renshaw so it seems Jake Hyde he's, he's come in handy um He's, he seems to be everywhere from the match reports. He seems to just love a pop shot and love a shot, which is good. Him and Mullen up front this season, I've said it enough times, I think are going to be class. And on 38 minutes, Wrexham opened the scoring. You know who it is. It is Paul Mullen. He hit a sweet bending right foot shot from 25 yards into the top corner to make it 1-0. And yeah, I, I can just imagine the scenes, the fans there seeing the first goal back and it's no other than the Superman Paul Mullen. On 52 minutes, Mullen was denied again by the Curzon Ashton keeper as the keeper scrambled across to save Mullen's header. He was apparently back backtracking and fumbled into his net after saving Mullen's header. So Mullen could have had a brace by now, but... It wasn't for if it wasn't for the Curzon Ashton keeper, but literally one minute later, Cameron Green, his first goal for the club, ends off pre season with a goal as he makes it 2 0. A deflected shot fires into the bottom corner, and 53 minutes 2 0 up against the team league below. We sort of knew it was going to be game over, but on 59 minutes, Curzon actually replied six minutes later with a goal of their own coming from a Dominic Knowles header from an Adam Thomas corner to bring Curzon right back into the game. Wrexham sort of, it's happened a lot in pre-season. We've conceded um, straight after the back of scoring, which I'm not worried, it's pre-season and all, but yeah, Curzon made it 2-1. On 74 minutes, Jordan Davis, as the sounds of it, really, really wanted to score his first goal back at Wrexham in front of fans. His free kick was only to find the back of the Rex rent stand. So Davis, unfortunately, was denied a goal. And then the attendance was announced 2,359, which is incredible for a friendly, considering I don't think there are away fans. 2,300 for a friendly, all season ticket holders is great news. You know, just seeing fans back in the race course, whether it's six, 7,000 or just as little as 2,300, it's still great. From the looks of it, people enjoyed themselves and Wrexham welcome back fans in style. And on 91 minutes, we weren't done yet. Dior Angus headed home into an empty net to seal the win for Wrexham. So it ended at the racecourse ground, welcoming back fans. Wrexham FC 3, Curzon Ashton 1. So yeah, that does conclude the video. There was actually only one trialist at the back for Wrexham, as and of, as the, of the sounds of it, it is that David Jones, formerly of Burnley, 36-year-old, very versatile, can play centre-mid, CDM centre-back. So yeah, good to see him in the start 11. He made a nearly made a mistake um, by the sounds of it. But yeah, great to see fans back. Please make sure to hit the red subscribe button, hit the like button, and drop a comment down below where you think Rex will finish. And I'll see you guys in the video. Take care. Great win for the Reds.